Hi everyone. Now we will talk about inspecting modal feature in Laravel. So first we will discuss what is inspecting modal feature, how we can use it, why we have to use this feature, how we can check database table details with the help of this feature and at last we will discuss some important interview questions also. This is the playlist for Laravel 11 tutorials and that will definitely help you out for Laravel project, job and interviews. You can access this playlist from the description box of this part. All right. So now let's talk about first question. What is inspecting model? See inspecting model means checking the details of any particular model in Laravel. See whenever we are creating any model in uh, uh, Laravel that is directly linked with the database table. For example, in last part we created student.php model and this is related with the this students table and similarly we have one more model with the name of user and this is related to the users table right so if we want to fetch details from the students table like uh, we want to get any student data or we want to update delete or anything we want to perform any operation we want to perform with this database table then we have to use this student model right so in inspecting model we can get the details of this table uh, with the help of this uh, student uh, model how we can do that and what kind of detail we will fetch so we have to run a command and that command will tell everything like name of table database name type of database as well as how many fields we have primary key unique key and what is the data type of these input fields everything we will get on the uh, command line and again you can ask one question why we need to check these details on the u uh, on the terminal why we cannot directly check in the database see sometimes we don't have ac directly access of the database second thing to log in with the database opening the new url and then checking everything it takes some time right so better is just run one command on the ui and that uh, on the terminal and that will give you the all details about this table and now let's see how it's actually work so what you need to do you have to go to the uh, terminal and then simply run php artisan space model then colon show and your uh, model name so right now let's say you want to check details about this student model so you can just simply put there student and hit enter and now you can see that we have all details about this model so database name is mysql table name is students here you can see that and uh, id is basically the auto incremented and this is the unique as well and the type of this id is integer and the uh, character limit is 30 here you can see that and second column we have name with the where care 100 value email and batch is also where care with the 100 value and if you want to see there you can see all of these details if you check the check out the structure here you can see that all details so better uh, if you want to check the details you don't need to go in the database and then select table and then do everything you can directly run this command php artisan model colon and then you can uh, put show and your uh, model name and it will give all details there and you can ask one question like that we can understand if database table name is plural then our model name will be similar and it will automatically fetch the details but what happen if uh, we just give the table name manually for example so here you can see that our table name is let's say college let me just make it college underscore student we have this table name and will it work so in right now it will not work if i just run this command you will see uh, table name is this but there is no attribute and uh, uh, nothing like this reason being because we don't have this table in our database so if because this table is mentioned there and now you just change this table name operations and like this now you will find that every details will be same as previous here you can see that and now you can see that table name is also changed and we mentioned the table name here and this is completely work fine like integer uh, id type is integer and uh, uh, maximum character limit is 30 same for name email id and batch auto increment uh, unique everything is mentioned there right so that's why we can use uh, our uh, inspecting model feature that will directly give you the details on the terminal one more thing see uh, you can ask like in which conditions inspecting model feature will not work second if your table name is not mapped with the model 
second thing uh, this is the first thing and second thing is let's say your database is not configured in your env file or in your project that's why uh, in that case also uh, that inspecting a uh, model feature feature not work right so i hope that part will helpful for you if you still have any question any doubt you can ask me in the comment section this is my paytm number for donation and if you still have any doubt confusion you can ask me in the comment section please like this video share your feedback in comment section and subscribe my channel thanks guys